Oh, hi there. My name's Mark Phillips, and today, I'm gonna find a Taco Bell in Brooklyn. All right, let's go. My last two weeks here in Brooklyn have been uh, pretty entertaining, uh, food-wise at least. I've sampled many delicacies. Uh, I've had uh, Indian food, sushi, Italian food, New York pizza, Chinese food, steak from Uruguay. There's a lot of interesting things here in Brooklyn to eat. Every once in a while, you know, you come across something new and weird. Um, like these, what would almost appear to be uh, sour cream and cheddar uh, Lay's potato chips are actually roasted chicken. Uh, I don't know what the fuck this is. I'm gonna give these a shot. Oof. So, uh, the smell is, uh, kinda like what the pan smells like the next morning after maybe Christmas or something, when you get like that old turkey smell. That's, uh, that's what, uh, these chips smell like. Alright, again, I don't know what company made these, but they look exactly like sour cream and cheddar Lay's chips. This would be an awesome prank to pull on somebody at some point in their lives. Did I buy these from a joke shop? No, I bought these from a cheese shop, which is kind of a joke shop in itself. Wow. Maybe I shouldn't have uh, just brushed my teeth either, maybe that. It tastes like old chicken skin. Yeah, I have another one. You know what's weird about these chips? They actually do kind of taste like sour cream and cheddar chips but they definitely don't smell like it. So the point is, you know, coming from Chicago and all, uh, we like our food uh, Mexican and we like it shitty. What better shittier Mexican food can you get than Taco Bell? It's been a little while since I had Taco Bell, so I'm uh, kind of gotten a hankering for it. Uh, got a map here of uh, Taco Bells in the area. Now, I think the area encapsules maybe about 10 to 20 mile radius, so what I'm gonna do is try to bike to one of these Taco Bells and record my adventure along the way. Yeah, Taco Bell I'm gonna go with is that one right there, and I live up there somewhere. I checked the, the distance, I think it's about five miles or something, which isn't too bad. You know, I had to bike, what, seven miles to work every day back in Chicago, so it shouldn't be too bad. Although that was along the lakefront and it was scenic and not uh, Brooklyn. I'm not gonna use this for directions. I kind of have a mental idea of where it is. I know the address, 845 Flatbush Avenue. Uh, but other than that, I'm not going to use the map. I'm just going to bike in that direction and see where I end up. Could lose this camera today. Who knows? God damn, these chips are addicting. I don't know what the fuck they put in you. Roast chicken flavor. Flavoring whey powder from milk. Flavor. They put the sticker over the uh, rest of the ingredients, but I'm assuming there's no roast chicken in these chips. Alchemist, what up, my niggas? What up, my niggas? my hood. I'm gonna go over that way, <clears throat> and then I'm gonna bike down that way, and then I'm gonna go five miles that way. Now right, let's get this show on the road. Time is 2.42 in the afternoon, about 32 degrees outside. So, let's get some Taco Bell. Damn, ladies better know the time, niggas better hold it down. This is the big one, you only get once. Do it right, do it right now, and do it till it's done. Hey, show you about power, money, and respect. Or either you a coward, broke with no strength. So I think I'm heading south now, I'm not really sure. It's uh, kind of getting a, a shitty, but it's as shitty as you'd expect from biking next to uh, an expressway. And I haven't seen anyone get shot or shipped yet. So, we'll see. Let's see, we're, we're still hoping though, fingers crossed. So now I'm on Myrtle and Clinton. Uh, two names I recognize, but uh, mean nothing when it comes to knowing where I am. And yes, in case you were wondering, videotaping and biking feels as dangerous as it looks. I'm in uh, Fort Greene Park right now. It's a very tall park. I say that affectionately, uh, being a tall person myself. Uh, I'm basically up here, and I want to be uh, down there. One day I will recognize all of this and uh, call it home. 
that day is not today. I found it. Flatbush Avenue. That's Flatbush Avenue saying hi, apparently. Flatbush Avenue uh, does not look like a bike friendly street at all. So there is a very real chance that I can and will drop this camera today. West West y'all. Yeah, LA niggas. LA niggas rule the world, nigga. Y'all niggas gotta recognize. You know what I'm saying? Niggas don't wanna peep game. You know what I'm saying? But Fun fact, I was actually uh, lost on this corner about a week and a half ago uh, after I returned my uh, moving truck. You know, feeling familiar with the area. It's no fun, so we're gonna keep biking. So the um, tiny bag of uh, chicken chips that I had is uh, slowly wearing off. <coughs> You know what helped wash that taste down? I'm craving the bell. And I think this random pair of shoes next to me would agree. So these farmers at the uh, top of uh, Prospect Park here trying to deter me from my uh, quest to Taco Bell with their good looking food and their hot apple cider. So it's gonna be tough. So I'll, I will admit I was a little tempted to uh, buy some food from the uh, random Brooklyn farmers. Unfortunately, uh, upon inspecting my wallet. I only had $3 cash, so Brooklyn Farmers, if you can't accept credit cards, I'm going to Taco Bell. So right now I'm biking through uh I kind of vaguely recall from the Google map, and once I hit the end of Prospect Park here, I should be coming out afresh on some uh, awesome Taco Bell. That also depends on what side of this park I come out of because I'm just kind of following a road right now and I'm not sure where the hell I am. New York, you're safer and you're wasting my time. I think uh, I just experienced probably a 10 degree drop in uh, temperature. In retrospect, I probably should have worn a hat. Sometimes you get so wrapped up in looking for a Taco Bell, you forget that there's beauty in the world. So for uh, all of you at home who were uh, hoping I'd get lost today, uh, wish granted, wish granted, I don't know where the fuck I am. That fucking park got me all turned around. Now I see Ocean Parkway, Coney Island Avenue. Yeah, I don't know where the fuck I am. I am so lost. And cold <clears throat> parade ground. The fuck? Hey, um, I'm lost somewhere right now. <laughs> so I'm gonna go try to find my way to either Taco Bell or or home. But you know, we'll see what happens first. Well, folks, I don't think I've ever seen so many restaurants in one store. Fucking perfection, right there. As much as I would have enjoyed uh, getting uh, more footage of the Taco Bell and etc., as a person you understand that there are certain areas of town you take your camera out, and there are certain parts of town uh, you don't take your camera out. Got a lot of Taco Bell in me now. It's uh, starting to get dark. I'm actually freezing my ass off because uh, I think all the energy that usually goes into heating my body is now going into uh, turning Taco Bell into poop. Well, Brooklyn, it's been fun. Put some Taco Bell in my tummy. Got me freezing cold. And you got me lost on several occasions, so. You did a good job. These gloves, by the way, as good as they may look, it's actually just a regular biking glove on top of a $1 Walgreens glove. There's no real protection at all. Probably be better off just <coughs> putting Elmer's glue on my skin. I don't know what that meant.